What's going on guys? Welcome back to the farm. And well, we've got some things happening. Um, I, what I'm going to do is, uh, well, I'm going to hop around here. You, prob you probably noticed that uh, there's silage bells everywhere and that's because, well, I I noticed that the price for silage is really, really good right now. Um, so I've decided Oh, and let me go ahead and turn this off because I had it on because as you can see, I did do the the precision farming on here um, and I was getting ready to fertilize and something said, you know, hey, check the price of silage and I did and it's pretty good. So we're going to head up. Oh, that's rough. Anyway, um, we're going to head up and... Uh, we're going to sell some silage bales, see how much we can get. I'm really hoping we can do pretty good with this. Um, we'll see. Uh, you know, because I'm not really sure what we're going to make. But yeah, guys, it's right at the, the best price. I think the best price is $343. And the best price possible is $343. And we're at $338. So... I'm like, you know, I'm going to go ahead and sell some of this, get, get it moved out of the way, uh, because we did have to spend quite a bit of money um, to do the precision farming. Um, so I wanted to go ahead and, you know, get get, get that taken care of. Um, and figured we would do this to kind of build ourselves back up. Uh, don't know how well we'll do, but um, I'm hoping we'll do pretty well. Um with them uh but yeah it's it was just it was like i said guys it was just sudden um i'm really glad i looked though because we can use this money i'm really hoping that we can get maybe a tractor or or something like that um for a decent price uh, because we are putting a lot of hours on our little tractor and uh I don't know. We might get lucky. Who knows? Um, let's see if I can. But yeah, this truck is doing pretty well, I have to say. So that should be good. We'll see. But yeah, I wonder how much we'll get, guys. 20000 maybe? Okay, almost thirty-one thousand dollars, guys. So, a lot better than I was expecting. So we're gonna quickly go back and get the rest of these other bales. What am I? Oh, is the little thing not one up yet? Oh. Come on, guys, we're in a hurry. Yeah, we'll, we'll quickly run up and we'll get those other bales and uh, we'll see how well we do. I'm, I'm, sh I'm thinking it won't be quite that, but we should get about 20. Um, which now that we're empty, we should be able to just throw her in six, then go. You'll just have to give me a second there. Or not, just hit my trailer, that's cool. <sighs> but yeah, guys, that was that was a really, really good, you know, really good sale. I'm really glad that that I checked that because I didn't I didn't intend to initially. Um, but yeah, it it really these silage bills are really starting to pay off. Um Okay, yeah, I thought I turned in a bit tight on that, and I did. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping... <laughs> okay, maybe we should gear down a bit. Truck seems to be struggling a little bit to get any kind of speed. But yeah, I just, uh, I bought a, 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 um, a pallet fork, and I just moved the, uh, the bells around decently. I mean, they're still kind of... 
They're, they're, but they're to where we can pick. We should be able to pick them up with this. We do, guys. So, seventy six. That's not bad. Not bad at all. We will take that. Okay, so now we can just get back to the farm and, uh, yeah, I will see you in the morning. Okay, guys, welcome back. And, uh, well, it's still pretty early in the morning. It's still not quite sunny or daylight yet. We're going to get some snow. And in preparation, these guys have built a snowman before snow has even fallen. I don't know. Uh... But they've managed to do it and uh, as you can see I am doing a contract I got Dave over there working it I figured hey you know I'm doing precision farming if I'm gonna have this plow um, you know I'm I'm gonna have it earning me money you know seeing as it's not going to be really anything of, of benefit to me um, you know so I've got Dave on the plow and uh, well we're gonna use the old truck here to Oh, to pick up some of these marshmallows. Just get on down here and see how smoothly this goes in the truck. It should go fine. full trailer um, we can't really take these just yet because well they're not uh, they're not quite ready so yeah um, kind of wished it would you know they're 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 at around you know 30 40 percent um, but uh, as you can see guys we do need to get some fertilizer on this um, It's uh, the grass is growing, but by the time we get the the bales out of here, because you know at this point the grass is pretty much um, done for the season, I would imagine. Um, so by the time we get these bales picked up, you know we should be able to throw another thing of fertilizer down and be good with it. But that's kind of one of the reasons why, guys, I would really like to get a second tractor. And I mean, look, 
I would really love to get one of these three tractors, if I'm honest. I would, you know, really, really like that. But we just, we're not there yet. Um, I'm hoping that we'll be there soon. Um, but I don't know, guys. I mean, I really don't, don't know. I mean, we're, we're, we're slowly getting there. But, guys, the next big thing, 31%, not bad. They'll be done with that in no time. This right here is what I want to do. This right here. Well, if it'll let me. Well, it'll, it'll do it eventually, I'm sure. But that's 126000 but I do want to get that. I want to get that soon, as soon as possible. Um, so we can just kind of get, you know, move shop over there for, you know, for our bailing. Because, I mean, it would be so much faster just to take it up, you know. And over here... You know, and just run it up the road just a piece, as opposed to taking it all the way over there, over there. You know, look how close this is. You know, we could just run it right here and just put it somewhere. Um, I do want to check something too, because um, with with the cows and things, guys. I'm not sure exactly which one I'm going to do yet. Um, I'm still thinking about it, and, and they're, they're constantly coming out with these great mods. Um, so I don't know just yet which one I want to do. Um, you know, if you look at this one, I mean, it only does 80 cows, guys. 80 cows. Um, whereas this one does 50 for 100,000. You could do this one does 200. And that one does 240. Um, I'll probably end up going with this one. It is a bit pricey at half a million dollars. But I mean that would fit. I think that would fit nicely right there. Um, probably in here somewhere. Um, I actually may do the cows right here. I think right here would be a better... Better place for the cows, I think. Uh, but yeah, that would be so nice. And in all honesty, guys, we could probably get away with just one building here. Um, just that bigger building. Um, and then we could do the sheep. Let's see what we've got for sheep. How many sheep do we want? Honestly, I think... 250? Honestly, guys, I would probably just do this one. And just do 100 sheep. Oh yeah, that fits nicely right there. Actually, look at this. Just line it up with that little path. Or maybe that little path. <laughs> you know. Just line it up real good. Yeah, that would work nice for the sheep. You know. I think so anyway. I don't know. It's just, it's still one of those things that we're just, you know, it's still, um, it's, it's going to be up in the air what we do. But, you know, I, I think probably just keep this building and just get rid of that one. Um... You know, and, and just turn this all to grass um, from here back. Um, you know, just just for the cows. I mean, there's nothing else. But even if this doesn't uh, give us water, um, what I'll probably do is just right here alongside of the house, I'll just put something for water. That way it's right here at the animals that need it. Um, so I don't know, guys. I mean, let me know. I mean, what do you think we should do? What do you think would work best? Um, but yeah, I mean, I do want to do a lot of cows. I, and I'm really thinking, you know, because another thing I know with cows is we're going to have to put a, a you know, a, a, a pit somewhere for, for them near. Um, and we, we got to be mindful of that too. It's got to be so close to, uh, the actual cows. 
Um, so I, I'm aware of that. I know that we're going to have to make space for that too. Um, but yeah, that would be a really good place, I think. I really do think that. And uh, I'm just going to take this back home and, uh, you know, once they're done with the tractor, I will, uh, I'll bring you back in and um, we will uh, we will basically throw down some fertilizer and uh, you know see how that does you know see how see how much that helps our our field um, you know because and ha how much it helps our, our grade right our, our points um, because I think we're currently at 56 so just kind of want to see how that does and I wonder if that'll give us bonuses when we sell this silage I wonder if this would count as a crop um, if not oh well um, what I'll probably end up doing though is when we get cows because this makes so much um, so much uh, silage um, I will probably turn one field into something else um, you know, maybe something, you know, that produces straw or something like that because we'll need straw for the animals. Um, so I don't know, guys. It's just there's a lot of things that's going on that I'm thinking about right now. Um, but, uh, yeah, once they're done with the tractor, I'll bring you back in and we'll, we'll get that, uh, we'll get fertilizer put on those fields and see how that does for us. Okay guys, so we have finished uh, plowing the field. Now I'm doing some other contracts uh, currently as well. Actually, I need to pull one right here. Um, yeah, I've got some other cultivating contracts going on. Let me go ahead and uh, let me collect on this one. And I'm going to go ahead and accept the contract on that one because it's a small field. And that will basically make up what I, what I had to spend to um, to effectively uh, borrow the equipment initially um, so I'm not gonna bother repairing this just yet but I'm going to customize it because there is one thing that uh, that we need to add on if we can um, I don't know if we can hmm. well that is not good. I was hoping we could um, potentially put that on here, but it doesn't look like we can. So that's, uh, do we have to do that at the store? Maybe, I don't know. I would, I would imagine we wouldn't have to do that at the store. Um, but we'll go see, I mean, either way. It'll have to be done. We'll have to either let's see what's uh, what's came up for sale. Anything good, hmm. guys? I would really love to get one of these two right here. If I'm honest, Re I really, really would. Uh, but yeah, I need to get those sensors put on. So uh, I'll show you what I mean. You may have to end up just buying a tractor. Which wouldn't be a terrible idea. Um, we got enough to where we could buy this, which would be decent. Does it have enough? See, yeah, that's that's what I'm talking about. So you apparently you can't buy that on a uh, a tractor that you currently own. Apparently, I mean I didn't see that. Did I, did I look it over accidentally? I mean, I may have done, but I don't think I did. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not seeing that here. Yes, that is just not good. That means we're gonna have we're gonna be forced to buy another tractor. We don't have a choice. Um, which wouldn't I mean wouldn't be a bad idea, um, but it's not really something I wanted to do at the moment. 
let's see. Just looking at what we've got here. Oh man, I do like that. I do like that tractor. I wonder... Now I'm kind of curious. So apparently you can't do it on this tractor at all? Huh. Well, that, uh, well, that, that just, that's, can you do it on one of these tractors? No. No. So you could do it on this tractor. How much, that's only got 68 horsepower. It wouldn't be nearly enough. Oh, man, guys. I do like this little guy, though. Would it, can you, so that would put us over what we currently have though. Oh man. So it has to be 75 or less. It looks like I don't, I, I, can you do it on these? So you can't do it on that one, this little guy. <laughs> oh man. Well, huh. It doesn't look like you could do it on can you do it on, you can do it on this one. I do like that tractor, if I'm honest. I do like that. Oh, man. Can we do it on this little guy? Oh, if we could do it on this one, I would so buy it just to have it. But, no. Maybe one of these? I doubt it. But we'll, we'll look to see, I guess. No. Okay, guys, yeah, so we're gonna need to buy a tractor. <laughs> we're we're there's there's no uh there's no way around it. And so yeah, I'm I'm gonna do some work and uh you know see if we can't get us a tractor and I'll see you in a bit. Okay guys, welcome back, welcome back. Please don't hit me car. Um so what I've decided to do is I loaded up some honey and I want to bring it here. I think it's here and sell it and see what we can get for it. Hoping we can get enough to where we can at least get a tractor. Oh, look at that. We, we did get a bonus, guys. We did get a bonus. Good. That's, that's huge. I wonder if we did, did we I don't recall if we got that on our silage or not um, but that that is huge so what I did that for essentially um, is I'm trying to get us some sort of tractor guys uh, I didn't want to sell it I really didn't and that wasn't all of it that was only like five I think but we just we need to we need to get a tractor, and I'm thinking this is going to be the one that we go for. Um, I do, I, I just, I like this tractor, you know. Um, I, I liked it in Farming Simulator 19, and um, but what that means is, well, that means that the tractor that we have now, we're going to be getting rid of. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and buy this, and, uh, but yeah, that means the tractor that we have now, guys, pretty much done for um you know not not that i don't like it it's just that well we need to we need to upgrade to something bigger and i probably could have waited um you know to see what we get from those contracts 
But guys, I don't want to spend all my money on, you know, a tractor and then be broke, right? Um, I just don't want to do that. So what I plan on doing is I'm going to get the favorite down here, the, or the favorite. I'm not sure how it's pronounced, if I'm honest. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited about it because it's, one, like I said, it's one of my favorite tractors. Um, it's going to be able to do just fine, I think. Um, and I'm going to you know basically take the tractor that I have currently um, well I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna trade it in uh, see what they'll give me for it up at the shop I'm hoping they'll give me a decent price for it um, I don't know but we just we don't need two tractors that's in you know under 200 horsepower we just don't um, oh Go ahead and turn this off. Yeah, I'm really hoping they give us a decent price for this. Um, I'm going to probably... Well, I don't know. I, I might keep this. Because we, be, we may be able to use that. I, I doubt it, though. We, which we don't really need that at the moment. Um, so I'm, I'm just going to probably sell them both uh, unless it'll which I'm gonna try it on see if it'll fit on the little fin and if it'll fit on if it'll fit on the tractor then we're gonna keep it um, if it doesn't then well, well we'll get rid of it but yeah guys I mean this has been a good tractor but we've got almost 30 hours on it now and uh, yeah it, it could you know it's it's time to be uh, uh, you know, trade it in. And I don't know that we've necessarily got an upgrade because this is a really, really good tractor. Um, but it's going to be able to do the precision farming that we're needing to do. We don't need to worry about pulling that big plow uh, with with the fin uh, because we're not going to be doing that. Um, so we should be fine. We should be fine. Uh, I don't think we'll have a problem with using any of the implements we currently have with it. Uh, but I don't know, guys. I mean, I, I'm I'm excited, but in a way, I'm sad. You know, because I do like this. Tra I do love this tractor, actually. But you know, you may see this tractor again on a different map. Who knows? Um, maybe. I don't know. I, I like going with different things. Uh, I think the one that we, we got is a very good one. It's, it was within our budget. Um, and uh, it, I think it may even go faster than this one, maybe. I mean, it probably is not by much, but I think it goes a little bit faster, so that's a good thing. Which once they get field 18 done, we're going to have a little bit of cash in pocket. Um, so yeah, we'll just pull up and we'll, we'll test fit this. And if it if it fits, then we'll keep it. Um, and if it doesn't, then. Well, when the time comes and we need it, um, we'll. Uh, And we'll purchase one. We'll just back this up out of the way. Turn it off. Hop in the little old fent. Let's see. Moment of truth, guys. Does it fit? I don't think... What am I doing? I don't know. I'm crazy, guys. I really am. Oops. I'll just sell it with the tractor. Because, <laughs> like, right now, we don't need it, need it. Um, so, we'll just, we'll just sell it with the tractor to be a little bit extra. 
get out of it. Okay, so we'll just pull it in here. Which we should get about, I don't know, maybe 15 for the tractor. Oh, 19. That's, uh, we'll go ahead and repair it. And repaint it. Because I think if you repaint it, it... Oh, we don't have enough money to repaint it. Are you serious? Uh, what we'll do then is we'll repair this. Repaint this. And that should give us enough. So, $26,923, that's not bad. That's actually more than I was thinking. Um, so, that's good. I mean, that's put us back up to almost $30,000, um, which is a good thing. I do love this little tractor though, I do. Oh man, it feels good to be back in this, this little thing. It, it's, uh, it reminds me of when, when I first started playing uh, Farming Simulator 19. Because I remember I kept thinking, I was like, um, I, you know, I kept looking for like the perfect tractor for like a front loader. And this was, this kept coming up. Um, so. Yeah, it was, it was one of my favorites from uh, from Farming Simulator 19. And it's pretty quick. I mean, it, it really is. It's pretty quick. Um, in fact, I mean, as fast as this is, we could maybe even get rid of the truck. You know, just trade the truck in for a flatbed. You know, uh, I think that would be fine. Which we may do anyway. Because right now, guys, look, I'm not really worried about having a truck. I, I You know... I, I probably should not have even bought it, but I thought it was going to really, really come in handy with hauling stuff, and it, it's good at that, but, I, you know, without an actual trailer, um, it can only haul so much. Um, so, I don't know, we may get rid of that, um, you know, just to free up some room for, for something better. Um, let's see, if a good tractor, okay. I was going to be so upset if like a really nice tractor came up for sale um, right now. I would have been so upset. But I think we'll keep the truck for now at least. Um, but yeah guys, I mean one thing I will tell you um, is if you didn't do this before, I would definitely, when you go to, when you go to, you know, trade your vehicle in, I mean of course, you know, you should already know you should be taking it to the shop. Um, for vehicles especially, because you're going to get the most out of them there. But go ahead, take the time, repair it, repaint it, because it makes it, you know, it, it makes, the, you make more money from doing that. Um, so we're going to just go ahead and do this. Because um, I really am, I'm just kind of curious, um, you know, how this is going to do. Um... So we'll just back up to this. We should be able to do this one. Will it not? I was beginning to worry. Now, I'm kind of curious. I'm going to turn on just to see if. Um, Oh, seriously? Oh, no. <laughs> Why do I do that? Oh, I did it again. Guys, I know you're probably hating this, and I'm sorry. Okay. 
So. Activate all automatic replication rate. So is that all you need to do? I mean, like, is that it? I don't know, guys. Moment of truth, I guess. Okay, we're getting it all the way over there. I wonder if this is going to save me. Or cause me to have to use more. Okay, guys. Well, I've got the fields fertilized. And what I have found out is... Based on the usage rate of the fertilizer, the the initial fertilization stage or, or application that you do is going to be very, very heavy. So you do go through a, a lot more uh, fertilizer than you would normally um, just because of that. Um, so that that's one thing I would you know I would tell you um, is you're going to burn through fertilizer like crazy that initial application. Now as far as the second application goes, I don't know. I haven't I haven't made it that far yet. Um, I do know that uh, you know the grass theoretically should have already had um, one stage of uh, fertilization as it is um, and it doesn't even look like you can see that now apparently so yeah you don't you can't even see the fertilization at this point um, but if we get out um, it doesn't even tell you the percentage um, but if you I mean if you look at everything everything looks good um, so yeah, I, I don't know guys. I mean, it's, it's definitely changed the game. Um, I, I'm, I'm guessing we may have to do one more stage of fertilizer. I, I don't know. Um, but, uh, I really, you know, it's just, it's kind of odd to me. Um, so I don't know, but it, I will tell you the initial stage of fertilization, you, you burn through so much fertilizer. I've went through probably between these two fields, probably seven bags. I think it took me like maybe three the last time for these three fields. Um, and a majority was on the, the big field over there, um, which the same again. I mean, a majority was on the big field. But the, but the odd thing is, guys, even though I've did the fertilization, right, um, my score hasn't changed. It's still 56. Um, so I don't know. I don't know if and when that'll change. Um and the funny thing is, it's showing my soil sampling isn't maxed out. But if you look at this, soil sampling's maxed out on that one. I don't know why I did that, but we'll go back over to these. Soil sample's maxed out on this one. And it's maxed out on this one. But overall, it isn't maxed out. So I don't, I don't know. Like it, I, The only thing that I can think of is this little section here. But I can't, I can't do anything with that section. I can't, like if I buy the map, it doesn't show anything. And I guess it's because it's just not plowed up. Like I'm wondering, am I going to have to manually do that to get a good score? I don't know. Um, but it's just things that I've found. Um, and I'm sure that like on a... A, an in-game map, it'll probably work much better than on a, on a modded map. Because as we've seen, you can't even use this equipment um, on modded tractors. So, 
you know, if, if you have a modded tractor, you, you know, you're, you're basically, you're going to be forced to, uh, you know, to purchase another tractor that's in game, at least for now, until, you know, the mods go out and, you know, if they do, if they decide to, and patch it. Um, so, yeah, I mean, you know, it's, it's, you know, it's definitely changed the, the, the gameplay a great deal. Um, I enjoy it so far. Is it something that, that could get annoying in the future? Maybe. Um, I, it definitely makes me want to get cows and possibly pigs now for Manir and Sleary. Um, you know, because fertilizer isn't cheap. Um, you know, so it's, it's definitely made me think about that. Um, you know, and that's definitely something that, that I want to do more so now than, than even before. Um, so I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see guys. Uh, you know, if, you know, if anything changes with that, um, or, you know, like, because there could, you know, there could always be patches and things. Um, I don't know. We'll, we'll have to wait and see. But, I mean, it's it's definitely added new elements to the game that, that wasn't there before. Um, so, that's that's a good thing. And, and I'm just, what I'm doing right now is, well, for one, I'm checking on my chickens. Um, so, we got we got a full thing of chickens here. Um, and I'm just going to go over and check this field and see what it tells us. Um, just kind of curious. So this one is, it's almost perfect as well. Um, so that's a good thing. It doesn't say weeds or anything, but I wonder, is there a place here that you can see it? No, maybe here. Because, I mean, before I never really had to deal with weeds because, um, well, so we got weeds here, it looks like. Um... So what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm just going to let the, the weeds do their thing and then I'm going to um, spray them. And, and I just wonder if, if it's because these, these fields over here are grass, I, I'm wondering if, if that may be the reason why it's not giving my... I, I don't know. See, I just I don't know on that. Um, why it's not showing the soil samples across the board. Uh, you know, it's really, you know, I, I don't want to really just have to do this one little section, but if I have to, I will. Um, but let me go ahead. I saw that that contract was done. So let me go ahead and collect these contracts. Okay. So we're back up to 52,000 guys. So we're all right there. I think we're going to be okay until it's time to sell everything else. Um, but yeah, guys, it, you know, I've, I've just kind of been all over the place with this video and I, and I know that, uh, but you know, this is just kind of, I, you know, I wanted to, where I'm doing the precision farming initially, I wanted to, you know, just kind of let you guys, you know, in on, you know, what's going on, things like that. Um, you know, and how, what I'm finding that people may not necessarily be talking about, um, you know, and, um, I don't know. Um, so my, my, my battery died. It, it lasted for a while though. But, uh, anyway, uh, guys, that's pretty much going to do it for this video. Uh, if you liked the video, I'd greatly appreciate it if you'd leave a like. If this is content that you enjoy, I'd recommend subscribing to the channel. And guys, let me know in the comments below. I mean, what are some things I should do here? Should I continue going with precision farming? Um, what's the next tractor I should buy? Next spot of land, maybe? Next crop that I grow? The first production we do? The next animal? You know, whatever the case may be, let me know in the comments down below. 
And if you want to share the video, feel free to do so. Share it with your buddies. Uh, but with that being said, have a wonderful day, night, evening, wherever you are. Have a good one.